On to the third member of the Elite Four, which is actually the first familiar face. It's Bruno. He has Pokemon ranging from level 42 to 46 and specials in fighting like last time. And he starts with a Hitmontop, which is a brand new Pokemon at level 42. Now, he actually went down to one Onyx, so he's definitely more fighter oriented, but this guy's about as straight up as you can go. Just go with Psychic Ties and Flying Ties and, yeah, just beware of his um, move sets. Otherwise, you're fine. Oh, wow, Magma. That's interesting. Am I gonna fight Dragon? Oh, it's Bruno again! Hey! I was wondering when I'd see a familiar face. I am Bruno, the Elite Four. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, we trained to be the extreme because I believe in our potential. That's how we became strong. Can you ascend our power? Hmm, I see no fear in you. You look determined. Perfect for battle! Ready, Autumn? You will bow down to our overwhelming power. Hoo-ha! <laughs> Although when they make noises. Alright, so the third one, which is Bruno, he is a fighting type gym. Well, trainer. <laughs> Although he's definitely more fighting type in this game because he only has one Onyx, and uh, pretty much the rest of his Pokemon are pure fighting types, including this one, which is a brand new Pokemon introduced in this generation, which is Hitmontop, which is, um,. Well, you'll come to find out that there's a whole evolutionary tree involving the Hitmon. Aw, oh, you bitch. It knows protect. Uh, well, it'll, it'll, work, it'll stop working eventually. Is it? Oh, shit. I better not be hitting up a pattern right here. I guess if I am. Oh, god damn it. What a little bitch. Alright, I'm gonna try one more time to see if it fails or not. Because I know he's gonna do that. Oh, come on! All three times? Ugh, fine, I'm, gonna I'm just gonna use Slash, whatever. Because Peck's not gonna be as powerful. Ugh, goddamn. Already, like, Dust got so much damage just because the computer's cheap. Uh, let's try Peck, let's see what that does. Alright, but and, uh, anyways, um, him on top you'll find, like, there's a whole family line of all involving all the Hitmon Pokemon. Like Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and this one. And uh, I need to heal up because I need to save for other battles. But um, a Hitmontop is kind of special because um, I'm trying to remember exactly how it went. I believe um, Hitmonchan specializes in attack. Like his attack set is higher than normal. Uh, Hitmonlee is uh, higher in defense, but Hitmontop is supposedly balanced in both attack and defense. So. Yeah, it's, a, it's definitely the most balanced of the fighters, and it, unlike Hitmonchan, it does learn, you know, you know, straight up fighting moves, and a, and a few other random ones too, like Rapid Spin or something like that, but... Anyways, he's gonna send out his one Onyx this time, at level 43, so we're just gonna nuke it with Tsubaki. <laughs> ah, my throat. Alright, since I have a pretty much opening here, I'm just gonna go ahead and take it and heal Ducks up. There, now I'll be ready for another battle. Ha, <laughs> and he uses Bind, what a loser. And Bind on Spucky, yeah, 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 going through all this nonsense. God, I hope I don't miss. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, I think we're fine on the items for now. Oh, thank God, alright, we're good. <laughs> alright, so this, yeah, this is pretty much the one gimme out of this entire fight, so... Once you get done with that, you're pretty much done. Well, no, you're done with the easy parts, anyways. Alright, so he's gonna send his second Hitmon Pokémon, Hitmonchan. Which, like usual Hitmonchan, like, I'm gonna take out a leap and save this. It probably knows Thunder Punch, Ice Punch, and Fire Punch. So, it has a tremendous range. Uh, the downside, of course, is that it doesn't really learn too many fighting type moves, I think. I, I'm trying to remember. Like, it didn't in Generation 1, I know that. Like, it didn't learn any in Generation 1. Oh, so close. Oh, wait, Ice. Yeah, just... Just forgot about that. Ah, oh, didn't do that much damage. Yeah, the Elica's... I just remembered, the Elica's defense is slightly higher than all its stats, so that was a good choice for me. Alright. Alright, so odds are he's going to send out the last of his Hitmon Pokemon. Yep, Hitmon Lee. Like I said, it's a more defensive-oriented one, but definitely has a few fighting-type moves of its own, including High Jump Kick. 
It's just probably one of the more powerful fighting type moves you can find out there until, like, the advent of, uh, Dynamic Punch. Alright, I hope this guy doesn't have... Okay, he doesn't have Detect, like a little bitch. Alright, probably take another turn to beat him. Oh, wow, I one-shot him! Huh. Well, there you go, the power of Farfetch'd. <laughs> Alright, but now his last Pokemon, and it is definitely his most powerful Pokemon, it's Machamp, the final evolution of Machop. Level 46, he's officially out-leveling me, so this is gonna be... Ooh. He knows Rock Slide, that could be a problem. Uh, I hope I one-shot it, uh, nope, not quite. Alright, I can probably survive this at least once, just so I can get up back into the air and kill him. And it crit, it didn't it? Yeah, it crit. Figures. Well, it's almost dead anyway, so... I just hope I have some revives. And not max revives. Um... Yeah, let's send you out. Because it doesn't really matter what I do. It's not gonna... It's special, de it's special defense is probably gonna be lower than its regular defense, so I'll just do this, and I'll probably obtain it. And there we go. Alright, so... One casualty because I got... Screwed over with crits again. Oh wow, we're starting to hit 100s with guitar now. Let's see. Why? How could we lose? <laughs> I love how they always say this, and they, they only go in with like one type of Pokemon. I don't know. Just never really made sense to me. All right, let's see if I have a revive. I should have at least one because I haven't been using them, and I have one. Oh. Uh, now comes the part where I start regretting not buying anything. Um, I mean, I have a few super potions, that's about it. Um, yeah, that's close enough, I guess. And then, let's get a regular potion on Elika. Eh, I'll just use... well... nah, never mind. Alright, uh, let's see, who do I want in front this next? I'm actually kind of unsure about this next one, because this one, next one might be a bit of a difficulty. I think I just realized about Umbra's, um, well, no, Umbra's not gonna be, but I, I needed something to take out that Umbreon next. Um, let's see, yeah, uh, let's just go with Helica, hell. Alright, so let's move on. 